Mechanical design engineer Saad Al Healy and his wife Iqbal were on a camping holiday Wednesday afternoon in the French Alps when they were brutally gunned down on a remote forest road near Lake Annecy. Saad spent time during the 1980s at the internationally renowned Rutherford Appleton Research Center where radioactive material was made. Reports state that Saad's family owned an engineering plant in Iraq where he worked on a giant particle accelerator which can produce radioactive material. Reports further state he was spied on by Special Branch during the Gulf War and that his aerial satellite photo firm worked for the Ministry of Defense. The identity of the dead couple was based partly on the testimony of their four-year-old daughter who survived the shooting by hiding under her mother's skirt as some 25 automatic handgun rounds were fired at the family car. Police are hoping to learn more from the murdered couple's seven-year-old daughter who was shot in the shoulder and beaten in the attack and remains in a medically induced coma. The third person killed was an elderly Iraqi-born Swedish woman. Reports suggest she may have been the girl's grandmother. The fourth victim is a French cyclist who authorities suspect was cycling in the wrong place at the wrong time. Les quatre personnes sont mortes. At a press conference in Surrey in England, the French prosecutor confirmed the four fatal victims were each killed by two gunshots to the head. Searching for any possible clues to a motive, both French and British police began scouring the couple's home in England. Assistant Chief Constable Rob Price made it clear because the crime was not committed on British soil, Surrey police are taking a back seat. As you have heard, this is a French-led investigation. Surrey Police will do all we can in the support of the effective um, investigation on behalf of our French colleagues. Price also confirmed the surviving daughters are secure and being cared for. Investigators are looking into a possible family feud over money between Saad al Healy and his brother, but that sibling has denied such claims. But for now, a planned attack by professional hitmen over Saad's links to his nuclear past remains the most plausible scenario. Sonia Artero, TVB News.